I saw talk on the uh, pop up on my notification feed for because the Dragon's Dogma Reddit's now showing up on my my Reddit app notification feed because I've been there a couple of times. It's an annoying little feature on the app sometimes because you just see fucking sometimes spoilers and shit. Um, but the thread mentioned something about Dragon's Dogma 2 not having quest markers for side quests. And that has me concerned. <laughs> That's not exactly what I want to hear. <laughs> I quite like, like, you know, quest markers. If you're not going to have quest markers, you have to have very detailed quest logs. And a non-annoying quest log navigation. So I guess we'll see how that goes. I don't know if that was like speculation, like somebody wants them to not have that. Because some people do that. They're like, no, quest markers are really annoying. I don't want to be handheld by any video game. And I think a younger me could agree with that, I guess, a little bit more. But as I get older and more, like, forgetful and dumber, <laughs> I will happily take quest markers. You know, it doesn't have to be like, oh, giant arrow pointing your way to the thing. It can just be like what we have here in this game. A circle. Pointing to a spot on the map. Hey there, boars. <laughs> I was hoping to get, get some meat off of them. You know, really sad story because I'm thinking of bacon now. That happened uh, a couple of days ago. Went to the grocery store. Uh, you know, obviously got a bunch of groceries. One of those things was a pack of bacon. Now, because the, the cart was really full, I had got a couple of waters, one big thing of, like, paper towels. It basically filled the entire cart up. So, when I was leaving, I had to put the bacon in, you know, plastic grocery bag on the bottom, like, shelf of the cart the off not used area. I was like, yeah, screw it, they'll be fine. So I put it down there, along with the other stuff that was obviously in the bag. Um, and while I was rolling the cart <laughs> to the car, the bacon fell out of the bag. A hobgoblin arisen. And I rolled past and I was like, oh shit, okay. So I put it back in the bag and I was like, whew, close. You know, it was a little... made me worry a little bit and then tragically like 30 seconds later it fell out again but that time I ran over the bacon and so the package had been ripped open and the bacon was covered in like dirt and tread marks from the Walmart parking lot I was really sad about that And now, you can be sad with me. But the bacon was not salvageable. Seems people lived here once. I just had to throw that away instantly. And I was like it's 10 seconds spot. away from the car. I think I also hate being lit on fire. Coming up here without a weapon in hand? You fool. Did it. 
You dare raise your sword to me? I'm gonna be sad to lose that grab ability. It's just free damage on an enemy and they can't really do anything about it. Hmm. That's a big boulder. Is it gonna roll as I get closer to it? Oh man, why is the boulder gonna do that? That's not my fault. <laughs> I wonder if the AI is even capable of like knowing the boulders coming at them. Do they see the damage field coming to them? Or are they completely unaware of it? This path runs the canyon floor. We'll need to stay wary. What the fuck is that? Oh boy. Oh, it looks like a dragon. Oh shit. Okay. Okay. Well, uh Gonna make a save here. Think I may be Devil Fire Grove. I think I've read the words Devil Fire Grove and like following words of contempt. Fuck it! I'm going in! Oh, that's a lot of health bars! Draw near fallen allies and press E to revive them. Well, who's down? Oh, shit! Go! Oh, no! Ugh. <laughs> I don't think this is gonna happen, but I'll give it a couple more more tries just to uh, amuse myself a little bit. <laughs> oh boy. Bring it on, dragon! That's true! That's why we have you! That's uh, fire! Oh no! I got knocked down from it! Maybe I can climb the tree. <laughs> oh, nope. But what if I grab onto your tail? One more, one more go, you know, I didn't even get to hit it in a, in its glowing weak point. But yeah, I don't think I'm doing any damage to it. This is one of those games where they, they go, oh, your stats aren't high enough, you do zero damage. And that sucks. I'm not seeing any movement on that health bar. Ooh, oh my god, the fucking goblin knocked me down! Their kind is weak to fire. Why are they walking up on this dragon fight? No self preservation. Oh my god, we made some progress on the health bar. Only. <laughs> only the ni other 99% to go. I'm pressing E on Lazlet, Jesus. Alright! I'm on the back of the 
the dragon! Let's rumble! It's not working out. My character's just struggling to even keep hold. Oh no. That doesn't seem good. Goodbye! Good luck, everybody! <laughs> oh, that's a lot more fucking goblins. Oh boy. Do these tripwires even do? <laughs> they they set off a trap, or is it like a sound thing? Like you trip it, and then the enemies are alerted. Yeah, well, I can't fly, so if you can get back down here, I can keep chipping away 0.0001% of your health bar every attack. Yeah, that makes sense. You fine. You gotta be kidding me. Let me on the rock! Ah! I was like an inch away from that. I don't. I can't do that! I am but the simple sword wielder! Oh no! Oh, Shira! I am your master. <laughs> no, let go of him. Well, this isn't like the dragon, right? Like the dragon we fought was like a deep red. I think it was a lot bigger too. This is just some other fucker. Uh, this isn't good. So is this one of those attacks where it goes really high, we can't see it, and then it just fucking slams onto the ground? Or did it go back to its spawn area? The health bar hasn't gone away, so it's still got to be around here. I think it's a good time to leave, though. Hmm. I guess not across the water. A deer, perhaps. Best we keep our distance. I just want to go to the the fortress. Oh, hi, goblins. The health bar has gone away, so I think we're good to just fight. I got one of my mages like that. Oh no. What? I don't know what he tried to do. <laughs> it threw a vial down as I grabbed it. Oh, 
I do love that I was able to block like the dragon's claws and wings with my shield without having to like invest any kind of crazy anything into my my shield defense Guess we keep it moving. Oh shit. I can't see the differences between these goblins in the dark. I mean, I kind of can, but like these ones have like a crown. That's what I'm mostly concerned about. They have to be like a leader hobgoblin. The game doesn't consider me in combat at the moment, because it lets me save here. So that's nice of it. I don't have to worry about the dragon as much, I don't think. West failed? What fucking quest just failed? <laughs> just the dragon fight? Oh well. What is this place? He's known as the Shadow Fort, built to ward against a goblin invasion. We're here. I see. The Shadow Fort. Damn, yeah, this feels like Lord of the Rings right here. Fine armor. That man is likely to be the captain. Is it that fine, though? I guess it's okay. Well met, sir. I take you for the arisen. Sir Maximilian informed us of your coming. By your leave, I would ask you spearhead our force here. Our tactics are as such. We aim to strike from the front gate, but lack the time and means to batter down the doors. I ask that you pass through the hole you see there. Lay open the gate from within. I cannot say what may await you within. Danger is great, but I trust you will prevail. Okay. Oh, yeah. Let's look for a way underground. Familiar with this question. Yeah, I can do that. Uh, before I go there, I should probably go stash some stuff. So first, I'll throw down a port crystal. Port crystal. Seems it can't be used now. Fuck. Okay. Well, shit. Cause yeah, our characters are in a rough state. Let's hope that leaving doesn't fail this mission. Oh god, that has me real worried. Fuck. Dad, I wish there were multi slots. Fuck it. We should be able to leave and come back. I think the fail condition for this is just main story progression. He's known as the Shadow Fort. Okay. Then from here, I can put down a poor crystal. Built to ward against a gob. <sighs> the 
Eternal Fairy Stone! Get me out of here! It is a port crystal, Master. What meaning do you suppose those stones hold? Uh, listen to Lazuli. So she said it's a port crystal. Do I have access to that augment I was looking for? Sinu, grant you the energy to carry additional weight. Yes! I gotta see what the other thing I was looking for was. So I still got a little bit more to go. It is uh, a rank 8 fighter thing called the Hemants which gives 10% strength. So we're, we're gonna have to stay on the class for now. We still got a good ways to go. Plant the blade into the earth at one's feet. Though its range is limited, the force behind the thrust is great. Compass slash. Spin with blade extended, drawing a deadly circle. Especially effective when surrounded. Employable while under attack. Well, I kind of like what we currently have. Besides the... I haven't really been using Heaverboard Lash. That one's kind of just like awkward, but... We'll keep it, I guess, for now. Um, I don't remember the name of the thing I just got. Or what my current ability is. Let's see. Okay, so the thing I'm thinking of right now is Flesh Skewer. I haven't really been using Shield be at all. I don't know what this means when it says, Shrinks the user's window of vulnerability. With a faster blow. I guess, Okay, so I guess that it... When it says it shrinks the user's window of vulnerability... At first it sounds bad, but I guess it's good, because it, it's, it, you're less vulnerable, is what it's trying to say. Sure. We still have three ranks to go on this, before I get vehemence or whatever, so I might as well grab these. What will it be today? your pick any you like what will it be today okay stash all these materials that are weighing me down what will it be today maybe withdraw some healing items i need to find someone who sells hard spud sauce or whatever and just buy a bunch of those also. What will it be today? And your then pick. I also what need today? to set that augment for Sinew. What will it be today? So your now, pick. you like? What will it be today? <laughs> now, my inventory says very light, even at twenty-three weight. Nice. What will it be today? That's massive. So I can have like kind of like a medium-ish armor. And a few like health potions without it being too bad. Alright, let's rest. Today? Stay till morning. <laughs> this accessing server stuff is so awkward. Everything else is so fast, and that was just like, nope, hold your fucking horses, bud. Anybody want to go to that fort? Sir Bourne wants to go to the Shadow Fort. Mercedes wants to go to the Shadow Fort.
Sure, Mercedes. Greetings, Mercedes. Hello. At present, over half of the core is made of cell swords from other lands. Each outstrips the next in skill and judgment. And for all the battles they've shared, they've been together as a family. They are formidable. And I am thankful for it, though it makes the task of leading them more of a challenge. Unlike your pawns, they've will aplenty. They'll not bend, else to one they respect. Well, hey, let's get you out there, I think. Uh, tools. Should I put this on two? Okay, no, two. You can't put it on two. But I can put these on two. If I'm ever at a scary low amount of health. <laughs> well, the whole party's in trouble. I'll just have to remember to press two or three. I don't know if I will remember. I thank you. It is very kind. We I did it! Escort mission complete! Acted as a reliable travel companion. Yeehaw! I should probably do the other one too. Oh wow. Lustrious Targe. Shield wrought of rare iceberg ore, dazzling to behold and favored by the most accomplished of knights. Is that a better shield than what I've currently got? Raises the strength up by a little bit. Has a bit more stagger power, knockdown power, just seems like a bit straight up upgrade, all right. Back to town. All these workers going about their business. What does it cost to upgrade my current gear anyways? Me, I'm the master works all. Uh ooh. I could throw the rugged tusk I've got into this. Sure. We've got a bunch of rugged tusk anyways. Thirty nine thousand plus some civil war. Yeah, yeah, we can match that. Uh. Why, yeah, I can upgrade my boots to level three. Aged insignia. And chainmail bracers. <laughs> and I can afford one upgrade for my Ruminator's monocle. The master works all. Is there anything for Lazuli I should upgrade? Freakish scale. I only got one of those, but yeah, sure. At least with her, she's probably going to keep a lot of her stuff for a lot longer than I'm keeping my stuff. But I made those upgrades under the, the hope that if I do go to Warrior, I can still use those particular items. But I don't know. Warrior might not have the shield and sword. Here we go. All right. The master works all. You can't come again. Big upgrades. Well, then I guess I should take a look. Have your pick. What will it be today? And see if there's a better ring for me. Swordsman ring. Blink strike, burst strike. 
that might be useful. What will it be today? Have your pick. What will it be today? Yeah, I use burst strike. Okay. Come again soon. Unequip. Equip. All right, Sir Burn. I would offer a prayer at the resting place of my fallen brother in arms before I leave on the Great March. An escort would be most welcome. Come along. Here we can rest, manage well inventory met, skills, and so on. We journey to the Chateau Fort. I thank you from the depths of my heart. We is no I did it. I, I did a second escort mission. I'm so responsible. Yeah. Also looking at the map, it looks like there actually might genuinely be a side path from like here outwards that I could have taken. You know, rather than going up this path and running into a dragon, 